In deciding whom to interview, employers are wise to use resumes not just to look at the candidate's reported work history, but to compare candidates' ability to think, organize, and clearly present their information. Those skills are so key to many jobs. So if someone uses a pro or even a friend to write or even edit their resume, that's unethical. It's, of course, unfair to candidates who wrote their own resume. And a resume writer is also unfair to the employer who used that phony resume as part of the hiring decision, thus saddling the employer with a worse employee than otherwise would have been hired. A resume writer is also unfair to the coworkers in that job who were forced to work with a worse person than if a resume writer hadn't committed the subterfuge. In other words, the person wrote their own resume. And ultimately, a resume writer is unfair to society because when the best candidates are not hired, we will all suffer worse products and services. Let me ask you this. If hiring someone or even choosing a friend to write or even edit a resume were ethical, why do resume writers never credit their work on their clients' resumes? The idea of making resume writers go extinct is one of the hundreds of ideas in my just published book, What's the Big Idea? Reinventions for a Better America. I hope you'll check it out on Amazon. I'm Marty Nemco.